Hey, good morning, everybody. It is David Townley with Townley Pool and Spa. I'm out here at Jessica and I's Pool Equipment. Kind of want to talk to you about some upcoming weather that we're going to have. It's going to be really cold, and I'm talking below freezing cold. So if you are still running your pool equipment this winter, and it's get below freezing temperatures, and for heaven forbid we lose power, I'm going to show you how to kind of properly protect your pool equipment. So let me turn the camera around here. And what you want to do, first and foremost, if we lose power and it's freezing, you want to go ahead and turn the power off at your pool equipment. So in your breaker panel, somewhere in there, secure power that way in case the pipes do freeze, you are taking control of when those pumps come back on. You want to run out here, you may have one or two or three pumps, and in the front of every pump, there is a drain plug. So you want to unscrew that and let that gravity drain out. And then again, over here on the side, there's another drain plug. So you want to pull both of those plugs and I'm gonna show you on this pump. Again, there's a drain plug over here on the side and one on the back. So there's two here on this particular pump. If you've got a sand filter like us, come over here underneath, there's another drain plug. You wanna unscrew that. And if you happen to have a heater like we do, we do have some valves that bypass the heater in the winter time, but we still undo those two unions and let that gravity drain. So again, step one is gonna be to turn the power off to the pump at the breaker, drain the equipment through the pumps, through the filter, through the heater, and then uh, when everything comes back online, make sure the pipes are uh, thawed out, fill everything back up, put your plugs back in, turn your power back on. Thanks.